Alright guys, update time. Currently, Kate is cleaning up the front of the motor uh, with a wire brush and a flathead screwdriver. Uh, we got it. Scraper. 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 Whatever. Um, got the motor torn down. We're currently in the process of putting it back together. Um, I just cleaned up the oil pan and the parts washer. That actually come out pretty good. Um, I cleaned up some other stuff here. Uh, the, I forget what this is called, but the Cummins guys will know what this thing is. It goes on the front of the motor for blow-by, uh, and it leaks the wheel out the front of the motor onto the ground. Whatever blow-by it has, I forget what that thing's called. But anyway, yeah, I cleaned that up. Um, I got some other stuff cleaned up. I don't know where any of it is now, but, oh, right there. I cleaned up this cover. Um, it doesn't look nearly as good as it did when I got it cleaned up but it because it dried up and it was still wet but it's in the process of getting put back together I cleaned up this bracket here um, it was way way worse than it is now um, so that's getting done um, we're hoping to have the motor out of the truck by the end of the day uh, that way it's ready for this one to go in we're hoping to have the truck up and running by Monday afternoon at the absolute latest. Um, that motor, the one that's in the truck, that motor is going to get built to around five or 600 horsepower. Um, I think he still has to put the injection pump in this one. Uh, at a, it's right there. Oh, he already put it in? Yeah, that's what he, he just did that. Oh, he just put that in. Okay, I didn't even notice whatever anyway no big deal well no I he wants I think he wants to take the injection pump out of that motor and put it in this one I don't know but he just put that one in yes he just put it back in oh, alright well I guess he's keeping that one in there for now I guess he's gonna use his better one for uh, for that motor anyway um, we still got a lot to do I'm waiting for him to get back so we can get the oil pan put on with the new gasket um, and we decided that we're gonna fix the oil leak on that motor uh, with all the other go fast parts that are gonna go on it then well, we gotta pull the camshaft out and uh, or pull the injection pump out and go in behind the injection pump and see if we can figure out how to do it from behind there I'm not sure yet but we'll get around to it. This is just an update video. I'll let you know where we're at with getting it put back together. Um, she's gonna finish cleaning up the front of the motor. Um, for the most part, it's as clean as it's gonna get. We're not gonna spend a, a lot, a lot of time cleaning everything because it's gonna get pretty oily again anyway. Um, he has some parts he wants to pull off the other motor and put on here before we even put it in the truck. Uh, he just can't turn the tuner all the way up because this doesn't have the bigger injectors that he has in the other motor. I think those injectors are going in this one, though. Yeah, right now he's got the plugs under the... Uh... Hey, he has the, the injectors plugged. Or the injector holes, that the inlets, the ports, or whatever. So, we'll give you another update when we uh, make some more progress. But, the motor's currently just hanging from the sky, getting uh, put back together. So, for the Cummins guys following this the series uh, of episodes or whatever. Um, we have a lot more for you. Uh, for the Overlanding and Durango folks, uh, that stuff's later. We're not really doing much with that. Uh, we gotta get her Jeep put together. Uh, I think she just fixed the lenses. Yep. We got brand new lenses, but the lenses weren't. Only the turn signal lenses work right. Yeah, the turn and signal lenses. Yeah, so how the light bulb twists in, they, they only made it a two notch instead of a three notch, like the bulbs we have. But she filed it out and got them in and got them tightened up. So, yeah, we'll do an update on that. Yeah, a little bit later when we get home. Um, hopefully, it's not dark by then, but we'll see. We got a lot to do yet. So, thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe, and stay tuned for the next video. Peace.